I'm Sir Tap Tap. This is Rememoried. This is a uh, exploratory first person, well, first person kind of game. Actions and the actions of your ancestors. I see. So, this game is apparently about three hours, so I'm probably just going to do kind of a quick look. Maybe 15 minutes, Stop. half minute, half, half hour, half minute. <laughs> Um, I mean to check this out for quite some time. It's uh, not exactly a brand new game, but I, this isn't exactly a brand new game only channel either, so I just figured I'd try to check out. Oh, my hand. It's a little bit. That's fine. Um, I figured I'd get back into more of some of this surreal, you know, kind of stuff that I like to do. Uh, been a little bit less on, this, on the channel lately than I've generally intended to do. Let's look through the little uh, telescope arena. How do? Perhaps I cannot do. Hmm. Can I go to cube zone? Give me the cube. Oh, cube! Cube! Oh god, cube zone. I was joking about cube zone. I did not realize cube zone was a real place. Cube zone is a real place where you will be sent. Oh. oh I think I died. You, you go to cube zone, you die. You do not come back from cube zone. I guess it's kind of trying to- oh. Mr. Eyeballs. I just noticed Mr. Eyeballs. Can I go to the tree? Can I go to pretty Mr. Pink Tree? Oh! I look I bad. Look bad. See, this is what they mean by the void looking back into you. There's the void. It's looking. It's looking! It's a pretty trees. I like these trees. Mr. Mr. Cube. Mr. Particle Cube. It's a good cube. Whoa. Uh, I don't know what I'm just... I can't tell if I'm doing that. I don't think I am. No. I pressed the space bar right as the first one popped up. Freaking spooked me. Oh, there's a jump button. Okay. There's two jump buttons. Mouse buttons. Oh, let's take a sit! Too few games let you take a sit. Is this a take a sit game? No. No, you can't take a sit in this game. You can pretend. Play pretend if you want, though. Cube. Impart me your wisdom. More of a frame. Whoa. I think I ate. I think I ate that frame. I definitely ate it, yes. See, this one does not get eaten. Who gates? Wait, is that a window? I think it's a window. Yeah, it, like, messes with the light a little bit. I think it's a window. I suppose it's just like floating frame, like, yeah. Can I go into the, the demonosphere? I don't think you're supposed to go into the demonosphere. No, you're not. Okay. I've always wondered, even if this isn't your kind of game, and you just kind of watch people want to do these on YouTube, do these kind of get you thinking? Would you like just... I like... Just being in a serene, interesting place myself. I, I don't really play these necessarily for pretentious, like, oh yes, this really makes me understand the feelings of the universe. Um, sometimes that is attempted, sometimes it's interesting, cool stuff, but just to be in an interesting, otherworldly place, I think, is a worthwhile endeavor once in, once in a while. Just something so other. I just enjoy that, I think. I think we're going towards the science. Oh, the Black Chaos Emerald, the rarest. Ignore the fact that there are two of them, it's still the rarest. Ooh, it's like a... It's one of those square cut ones, I like that. Oh, this is surely the chair that I can actually take a sit in. This, this is this is that SCP that gives you the, the, the finest sit that you've ever had. Or perhaps not. Well then, made, I've been bamboozled by the chair. Just a dock sign. Ooh! I got spooked by the <laughs> by the colors, or the lack thereof, rather. Oh, Mr. Mask Face! Mr. Mask Face, keeping your secrets. He's just here on the floor. 
it's not actually it's not actually anything important. Somebody just dropped that. Somebody was going to a Guy Fox convention, got got the wrong mask. Embarrassing. Embarrassing. And uh they just kinda dropped it on the floor. I was like, oh, I don't know how that got there. <laughs> I definitely didn't think this was a like a ballroom mask party. Oh no. Go into the abyss. Into the abyss, yes! Back here again. again this journey. Once again, Once again I'm again, paralyzed, paralyzed and drifting, drifting away, away with a flow of uncontrollable thoughts. thoughts. Let's see. Welcome, Welcome back. back. Deja vu. Welcome in the place where all the muses sleep. Apart from the only one making God of the stars. See, I, I genuinely wish I had dreams more like this. I, I, I Usually, if I have dreams, they're like. Like, just this last night, I, I dreamt that I was in, like, school. I, I have so many school dreams. I didn't even have, like, bad traumatic school memories for the most part. But I still dreamed that, like, oh, it's a week before finals. And then I remember, wait, I graduated college. I don't have to deal with this crap ever again. And then I usually wake up. I don't know if the intent is to leave. I triggered a story thing. I'm of two minds on these, like, figure out what you even ha do in the game kind of things. Like, I just want the narrative. I kind of... I want to see what there is to see. And... I don't mind an, a linear or, like, you know, simple-to-go through experience. Um, it seems... What? Huh? The rock ate me. The witnesses of your actions, actions. And the actions of your ancestors. Can I like platform on these rocks? Oh my god, I can. Am I supposed to be able to do that? Such that it is difficult. The tree! Yes! Yes! The stars have played with your head to make you believe for just a moment that they are in your reach. Mr. Deerface! Mr. Deerface, no! Mr. Deerface! Oh. It was Japes. It was Solar Japes, those stars. Oh boy, those stars. Oh, Mr. Doggo. Oh, chicken. What? Dog, chicken, this the same thing. Dogs are just as many, as many, wide as chickens many, many, with many, more legs. As many, 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 as many possibilities. Look in your heart. You know it to be true. Mr. Goat, Mr. Goat Deer Man. I want to say hi to Mr. Goat Deer Man, but no. The game says no. I, there's so many things to sit on, and the game does not have a sit button. I genuinely do enjoy when games let you just sit. Like, just the little things that make your character feel human. Um, I really appreciate that in, um... Animal Crossing is a notable game that lets you just have a sit. You can just sit. They'll be like, even if you chop down like a tr if you chop down like a stump, you can just sit on the stump like a person and just just chill. And I really appreciate that. The stars have played with your head to make you believe for just a moment that they are in your reach. I don't think stars form these like lines, these like math class lines. Do you know what's funny? In now math, they are everywhere. I learned to program in math class instead of doing my actual math. I don't actually really like math, despite being a programmer. Oh. Um, I, if I need math stuff, I'll, like, look it up, and I just, I don't particularly care for, like, complex math stuff. Uh, I do think understanding statistics is extremely important. I don't think it's necessarily the same, though, as, like, you know, just math. I think, ah, oh, japes. The solar japes continue. Um, I think understanding statistics and basic mathematical stuff is super important. Being able to, like, you know do the square exponent of pi reversed, you know, times imaginary three. As many um, as less many so. Memories. You don't need to necessarily be good at math, you just need to understand math. That's that's the important thing. You need to look at like, oh. You know, you need to be able to look at like, you know, gambling and stuff and realize, oh, the odds are not in my favor. I, just because I lost last time does not make it more improbable that I will win this time and, and such forth. 
Oh, it's lower this time. I did the right thing. I'm smart. Give me the black chaos emerald. Yes. That's the secret one. Oh, Mr. Seahorse! What is this, Seahorse Captain? Seahorse Sea Hell? I'm in love with the seahorses. They're so beautiful and cute. Seahorses. Forever. I love seahorses and seashells and seashell things. Like towels and little bags. Seahorses. Forever. So I <laughs> Every time I see a seahorse, I have to do that. If you j just Google drinking out of cups. I'm not kidding. Just Google drinking out of cups and you'll... you'll end <gasps> oh, so I thought I like ate. I was going to have an existential crisis. I thought I ate the, the seahorse. I, I, that would have been unacceptable. Um, is it just me or is it literally impossible to, to actually land on any of those right now? See, I just love a nice surreal, even if the story doesn't necessarily go anywhere, even if I don't feel super like, man, that was deep. Um, I feel like a thing like this is worth it, just to see such a surreal environment, just to walk around, just feel that sereneness. Like, these games, they heal your soul, honestly. Like, just, they put you in a relaxing place. Though I don't know how I can leave here. Mr. Seahorse, lend me your power. Seahorse, sea hell. Oh. I think I'm supposed to be more patient. I'm, it's kind of ironic that I love these kind of games because I'm actually super impatient and I, a lot of these games expect you to be patient and want to like play slow and stuff. And that, that is not me. That is not me at all. Um, I'm usually like, I want to go and see the thing. Like, I love walking sims, but I don't like when they, like, make you literally walk. Like, let me run and stuff. Let my people go! Oh, no. See, that's that impatience. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, seahorse. I'm sorry. The man, the man, the man creates the from your changing Okay, I get I understand. Allow me. Allow me to walk. There we, I, it's like different every time you turn around, I think. It's different when you turn around, okay. I wanna go to that. Oh man. This feels like when you're a kid and you make up like stupid rules for like games. And you're like, oh no, you can't, you can't, you're like playing tag. You're like, no, no, you, you can't, you can't tag me unless you have to walk around and go back. And you didn't do that, so you can't you can't tag me until you walk around and you touch that post and step backwards towards me. Kind of what this feels like. Though I mean, figuring out how a game even works that can be a gameplay mechanic in and of itself. I don't object to that. That's you know, it makes the experience a puzzle, right? I don't understand where to go, but. I mean, a three-hour experience, um, no matter how lost you get, it's not going to be super intolerable. I mean, I spent, uh, not quite three hours, but for, I was playing uh, Kingdom Hearts 1, and that game is ridiculously obtuse. I never realized that. Like, story, I mean, the whole meme is Kingdom Hearts story, haha. It makes no sense. But I did not realize that the first game was super non-linear and, like... Not even non-linear, it's just like, it expects you to go here, and then you talk to this thing, and then you go back to another thing, and then another thing activates, and like, none of it is telegraphed to you. It doesn't make any sense. It's very weird. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. To, forget to forget is so easy. easy. It's, it's just very strange. And the, the jungle level in that game is particularly egregious in that regard. I can't tell where I'm supposed to go. I want to go say hi to- am I supposed to go up? Am I trying to go up? I want to go see that big eye? Is that good or is that bad? Well, if nothing else, I get a better view of my surroundings if I can keep going up. I'd be really interested to see what the exact, uh, what the programming is for the move things around. It's like, this is like 
when your friend is like screwing with you and is like, ah, oh, you, every time you turn around, a different item is just moved in a different place. And nobody reacts to it but you and you're like, wait, am I crazy? Mr. Seahorse. The memory. Mr. Seahorse. Oh, oh, I, I get it. It's, so like your memory, an interesting thing about memory, um, Memories aren't like solid things that are like just, you know, you remember the exact details. You remember vagaries. And so I guess this is kind of trying to be like that. Um, you don't, you're not actually seeing like the layout. You're just remembering it. And so it's a little bit different each time, which is the case of real memories. That is actually pretty clever. I like that. Um, speaking of statistics, I think everybody should learn a little bit about statistics and stuff. Um, I think everybody should learn psychology and uh, some basic stuff, stuff about perception and stuff. So you understand, because I mean, you're a human, right? You got to understand how you work. You, your brain is basically you as you would think of like as the, the, the core functional thing, right? Um, you need to learn how you react to stuff. You need to ha learn how, you know, I, I would say at least a class on like sensation perception. And um, child psychology, a developmental psychology, was actually a really interesting course. Uh, I don't like kids. That was the only that was the only time I ever learned more about children, and I actually wanted children more instead of less after learning about them. Um, kids are pretty cool, um, mentally speaking. I'm still confused, but I still want to go up. Is that a thing? I just want to sit on one of these chairs. It's my, my only dream right now is to sit on one of these chairs. To forget, to forget is so, is so easy. Easy, easy, easy. Oh, I thought I was going to fall off. I was going to have an aneurysm. Okay. To forget is not easy, by the way. I would pay, I would pay upwards of a few hundred bucks to remove a few things from my brain forever. Like a few hundred bucks each. And I've got maybe... Three, four main memories that I'll go for for that. Oh, there's a ladder. Oh, there we go. See, I knew I knew going up. I would get my bearings and I would see like what where we're trying to go here. I was a little bit skeptical in the first like I wasn't sure if like I just had to wander and like activate something totally at random. But um, I like how this world works. Sometimes my brain just isn't in a puzzle mood. And I, I feel like I judge games a little bit too harshly like for, due to that sometimes. Um, I've said this before, but I'm a programmer and programming really, it's a lot of solving puzzles. I, I do a lot of problem solving. And when I play a super, like a tough puzzle game, um, it, it kind of sometimes feels more like work than it feels like a game. It just feels like why, I, I get paid to do something this difficult usually. Why would I? Why would I do this to myself of my own volition if I'm not getting paid? Like, you know, they're, they're more fun problems. They're you know, but not necessarily as satisfying. Like it work. I get to see people using the reports, the the web applications, the stuff that I make. Whereas a puzzle, you know, it's just a game. It's, I like games, but. Nobody's gonna be like I, I walk by people who on with you know my work on their workstations almost every time I go past it, and that makes me you know really think like wow. To forget is so, so difficult. difficult. <gasps> exactly, it is. Um, depends on what you're trying to forget. I mean, if you're trying to forget, you're almost already screwed because the memory is just kind of already so intense. And th this. There we go. I don't know why it's not. Doesn't seem to want to let me change these. Maybe it's trying to be like, forgetting is difficult now, so that's why. Oh, here we go, here we go, okay. Mr. Ladder, yes. It's the ladder way to heaven. A memory becomes a dream. A dream becomes a memory. Oh, a that's a Nifto effect. Birds. Alfred Hitchcock's the birds. I'm gonna find a thing that I can sit in one of these days, game. One of these days. Oh. Who left their space hookah on the floor? Who left it there? 
You know your crimes. You know your crimes. Oh, oh. Oh, got him in the Tesseract again. <laughs> I like that kaleidoscope effect when you're like out of bounds. Ooh. Interesting. I said I was going to do a quick look. I mean, I might just play it for myself. I don't know. Um, I'm getting into this though. I, um... Three hours is fairly long for one of these kind of things. Um, that does make that makes me interested in what all it does. Um, I'm I'm not I don't think a work is less important because it's shorter. I actually really like five to you know fifteen minute things. Those are some of my favorite things to cover. Um, they're perfect for a video. They're perfect for just like go through real quick, see something interesting, and nothing overstays its welcome. Kind of by virtue of just it's so short and. Um, it's really interesting what you can pack in that amount of time, but uh, three hours isn't an immense amount of time either, so it's interesting to see, obviously, a more larger, um, more larger, more, more better, um, <laughs> kind of exploratory thing like this. Mr. Gears. Mr. Gears of War. sad thing about videos though when you're doing a series especially as somebody who usually does like quick look stuff the first video in a series always gets twice as many views or more than any other view video in the thing um, except for sometimes you know like the ending if people google the ending a lot um, but if people are just looking for a let's play the first video gets so much more views and it's kind of it's kind of like aw oh 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 whoa whoa that is a pretty neat effect that this game does. I really catches you off guard, even though I just we just use a whole game mechanic. But when you turn, things are different. You don't expect that. I like this. Anyway, I was trying to say, like doing a series, like YouTube doesn't entirely reward that, and it's kind of a shame. Go this way. It's like I want to show, and I mean honestly. I usually show, like, one-off things, but... So it kind of almost works to my favor? Because I do lots of short things, but... It's just frustrating when I do really want to do, some, like, a longer, more complicated game and show it all. I, I know that so many people aren't actually going to see the whole thing. It does kind of drag in the back of my head when I start to do a, a, a longer play. Is that like my memories going away? If I if I look back, everything's gone. That's that's pretty interesting, really. It's like a much more interesting cube. It's like a much more interesting. Oh god damn it! <laughs> I did it again. Yeah, you know, I'm just gonna take a sit. One of these days, one of these days, I'm gonna find a chair I can sit in. <laughs> I'm not allowed to do that. But it's kind of like that thing where you don't turn around in um, Mr. Spooky Pasta games. Uh, Slender Boy, Slender Boy, and, and the Long Boys. Um, I never liked those games because, like, I want to see the spooky thing. I want to see the weird stuff. I don't want to just, like, hide from it. That's... Meh. Black Chaos Emerald, give me your strength. Emeralds are actually barrels, by the way. It's different barrel... Like, they're different colors. Um, like, a pink one's called Dress Barrel. There's also a Disgaea character, which is why I know this story. <laughs> um, but green emeralds are barrels. And I don't remember the other ones. Or aquamarine? I, um, Google it, you'll learn. Learn learn a thing! You know what? This is... starting to become a little frustrating again. Um, in my opinion, Google something interesting. Learn something every day. And in addition to that, every time you go, every time you go to the supermarket or something, buy yourself something new, something you never got before. Either a new food or a different brand of something you like, but like, 
Try something different, that's what I always tried to do. Oh, I had to find the other chair. I think. Maybe I didn't. It's the trees. Trees, wrap me in your leafy bosom, Mr. Trees. I don't think I'm supposed to go into the void space. Ear. It's an ear canal. See, like, just Google something interesting, like ear canal. Learn, learn things. You know, I always try to learn something new. Um, every week, at a bare minimum. If not, maybe you'd forget every day. But. Or maybe you get tiring every day or whatever, but oh. Is the sofa one of these days? Is that a sofa or a tombstone? It's kinda of hard to tell with the kaleidoscope effect. Um I'm like right beside it though. It's interesting. Am I supposed to yeah, no that's that's a sofa. What's better than oh. What's better than a null set of sofas? Six sofas. Heck yes. This looks like a cell dividing. I just want to sit in that sofa so bad. You don't understand. Oh no, it's gone. Oh no, it's it's still here. Just sit in the sofa. It's I can I, I don't even know. Was I supposed to despawn and it didn't work? I'm I'm pretty confused right now, honestly. Cause I just, there's this ear on the screen. I can't tell. I can't tell if that's supposed to be there. Cause this is usually what the game over screen has. The game over. But wh whatever is happening here. The gentle waters. It usually like shows you just the, the just the chair. Okay, so that thing is at our back. Let's just go as far as we can from it. And see what happens. <laughs> this is kind of one of those bugger feature moments, and I'm kind of starting to think it is not, in fact, a feature at the present time. At least we get some interesting visuals out of it, though. Oh, Mr. Gong, have I have I done have I done a good? Have I done good? Father Gong. I don't think I've done good. Um, I'm scared because there doesn't seem to be a menu in this game, so I don't know. I don't know if I am doomed and if I restart the game, if I will be in doom space. Well, let's see. Let's see here. Please. Please don't be. <laughs> Please don't be the start of the game again. I guess I would be able to get to that point. Possibly quickish. If, if this starts over, I guess we'll call that it for... I, I think... I think it's... <laughs> I think it's dead, Jim. That's unfortunate. Wait. No? No, it, it saved. It saved. Okay. Crisis averted. I still don't know what to do here, though, and I'm still... ...befuddled. So I think I might end the video here. Um, I don't really want to look up a guide, but... I think my brain is not currently in the right mindset for this. I do want to climb this rock, though. I wonder if- can I forget the rock as I'm climbing it? I sure can. I sure can. That's almost kind of silly. Ooh, what's this? No, no, what's that? There's a thing. There's a thing over there. I want to go to the thing. One final attempt. I don't... See, the last thing I thought that was really interesting with the look around... Oh, come on. I'm supposed to not do that now. Oh, wait, is there... If I sp When I spun really fast, I saw a sign pointing to a direction. But I don't... Oh! <laughs> this way. Okay. I'm not gonna touch anything. I'm just gonna walk this way. It's a really fine balance to strike in something like this. And we've kind of teetered back and forth 
from like last time, the looking around and like spawning things, that was really interesting. Whereas this, it's more disorienting. I wonder if you just go through these two columns. Is that, is it as simple as that? Perhaps it is not. Okay, at this point, at this point, <coughs> I will admit, I think it's gotten a bit obtuse for its own good. Um, I just want to go, I just want to use the Black Chaos Emerald to, to turn it into, into the super, super rememoried. If I look up, if I keep looking at my own hands, will I forget what my hands look like? section. Could have used a little bit de obtusificationing but Like I said, my brain might just not be in, this, in the right mindset for this, so I'll end this here. Um, I might come back to it if I get if I get in the mood and the mindset. Or I might cheat and look at a thing to see what we're supposed to do here. Um, I really like it. I just do think there's a certain point where you kind of cross the threshold and it's a little bit too obscure. And it's really hard to tell where you are at that. But that's kind of where playtesting kind of comes in. Yeah, I'm Sir Tap Tap. If you like more surreal interesting things like this, make sure to subscribe. And uh, I have a whole playlist called uh, Avant Garden. That was a cute little pun. And um, maybe I'll look at the water. Check that out if you like interesting kind of things. Which I hope you do.